Well, we ran into uh, the high wind that you usually get at Logandale Trail Systems. <laughs> it was uh, two beautiful days. For every two beautiful days, you get a day where it's windy. And last night at about dusk, the wind started coming in. And then by the time I got back from my dirt bike ride, it was blowing pretty hard. There's no way you could take the uh, awning down when it's blowing that hard. It's a one-man job with no wind. When you have high winds like last night, I mean, the flag was whipping even more than that. We probably 30 to 40 mile an hour, steady gust. There's no way you can take it off. Uh, one person can no way put that thing away without potentially damaging damaging it. And uh, I even parked the Can-Am Maverick right here to block the wind last night. I really... I did everything I could and it did rip a couple of the straps. Uh, one completely off, the other one is partially ripped uh, that hold the uh, awning wall down. And uh, that just shows you how, how brutal it was. But it did take it and the wind was blowing in this direction. So uh, the, the uh, shade wall actually acted like a uh, sail. So it put pressure, it put pressure down on the uh, legs supports and everything and uh, that's what helped it if, if the wind would have been blowing this way we would have had to go for it and, and try to take it down so uh, and we had a plan but you could potentially damage it in high wind like that if you damage it and those supports break off or bend you might as well throw it in the trash and that's like 280 bucks I don't think we want to throw 280 bucks in the trash do we no anyways we uh, got everything packed up. I'm gonna do a small ride today, a couple rides maybe. It's only about 11 o'clock in the morning and then uh, we'll, we'll see what's going on.